Do you break out into a cold sweat every time you have to calculate the tip? If doing math in real life makes you anxious, you're not alone. Math anxiety is a real thing, and here's what it's actually doing to your brain. Experts say that math anxiety is the urge to avoid numbers. It's seen in children as young as six, and it plagues more girls than boys. But it's not just an aversion to numbers, it turns out that math anxiety could actually hijack your brain. I'm Erin Maloney, and I'm a professor at the University of Ottawa. I study cognitive and emotional factors that can relate to achievement in mathematics. Researchers have used what's called fMRI, or functional magnetic resonance imaging. What we can see is that for people who are really anxious about math, they have activation both in the areas of the brain that are sort of responsible for mathematical processing, but also areas of the brain that are responsible for fear responses. So in some ways, for these individuals who are really anxious about math, their neural activation patterns look similar to someone who would say have a spider phobia or really an, an intense fear in a situation. So it's like your brain trying to solve two problems at the same time, anxiety and geometry. And that extra toll on the brain can cause a lot of students to underperform in math class. But the problem just doesn't exist with students. Research shows there are high levels of math anxiety with elementary school teachers and parents too, and that could rub up on the students, especially when they're trying to teach them about math or when parents are helping their kids with homework. So how do we solve this problem? Well, experts say that we need to stop with the stereotypes about math. Often, people who are really anxious about math will endorse stereotypes about math. So for example, they'll endorse the stereotype that some people just aren't math people. And I think that's simply just not true. So while math might come a little bit more easily to some people, what we know is that if you work hard and with the right instruction and the right mindset, really pretty much everyone can learn math. So in terms of actually strategies that we can use to address the anxiety, we've seen things like focused breathing, so mindfulness type um, activities that really help the students sort of decrease their anxiety before the test. So the next time the waiter hands you a bill and you don't know how much to tip, don't fret. Try relaxing, and that way you could tackle the problem with a clear mind. For more information, check out the links below.